Oh, hey. <laughs> Hello, we're finally back. I know. You guys probably miss me a lot. Yes. They've missed us. I'm not sure why, but we not decided. We decided that for our next video, it's not really that beauty related because let's be real. Um, we are doing, we're going to interview each other with the most random questions ever. They'll be funny. They'll be some pretty good ones. Side note though, we, we tried to like rehearse this and be like, okay, like let's get our shit together. We're like, no, this is that. stupid. Let's go. This is just off this the cuff. Mm -hmm. I mean, we wrote the questions like what, four days ago? Yeah. And we're not really sure what's on there anymore. So true yep. life. Yep. This is just as it comes to our brain. So <laughs> sorry. Get ready. I'm sorry. <laughs> this is this is this is what it is. Okay. So, fun. so are you ready? Yeah. Okay. Our list here. Okay. <laughs> are you gonna ask me um, first or mine? I'll ask. Okay. Okay. Because <laughs> I know the answer to this one. Mm -hmm. What is your spirit animal? I think I meant to say who, but or <laughs> <laughs> I did. Yep. What? Who? Doesn't matter. Either way. Who is my spirit animal? So, I mean, if you've followed me for any length of time, you know that I have, like, super girl crush on Nicole Arbor. <sighs> Makes her another region. <laughs> I just love her. I want, I want to be her. No, I just want to be like her. She's so great. I love her. She's a little over the top, and I love it. So, yeah, she's super my spirit animal. With the eye roll. Okay. <laughs> Who's your spirit animal? <laughs> She's a real great girl. So you guys might know her. It's not me. No, nope, it's not definitely, me. <laughs> definitely not her. Annie Wells, you are my spirit animal. You're Sorry, great. Annie. <laughs> Weird. <laughs> Love you. You're just so funny. <laughs> my turn. All right, what were you like in high school? Tell us all. Wild. Define wild. Like, what did you do? Mm -hmm. Mom knows about most of it now, so. Mm -hmm. Well, no. hey, whatever. What, I just like, mm, I was more like, oh, you want me to do that? Okay, I know I'm going to do the exact opposite. Like, did you sneak out of the house a lot? Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All the above. And, All right. um, All right. I'm not done yet. Okay. I'm trying to help you. <laughs> <laughs> but I had a lot of fun. And I'm really glad I'm past that point. You didn't catch anything or anything? <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> Okay, we're pretty oh sure god. she did. Wait, wait for the okay, Brittany. What were you like in high school? <laughs> oh my god, you guys will never believe this. Actually, you will. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you will. I was such a loser. <laughs> I was just really nerdy. I was really smart, really smart, and so I was just. Oh yeah, I was too. That's not real. <laughs> That's not true at all. I was super, super smart, and I just really didn't do much. I was too scared to sneak out. I was too scared to do any underage drinking. I was a good kid. Like, I was easy. I was, no, I wasn't easy. I was like an easy <laughs> child. Oh, yes, she was. <laughs> Ask her husband. <laughs> okay. I was a good kid. All right, Carol. Next question. If you were on death row, what would be your last meal? Oh, she likes to eat. Let's hear it. You're going to have to go and beat Stroganoff. <laughs> Tell him why. He told me. <laughs> Why did I tell you? You're in crop dust on the way out. <laughs> <laughs> I, yep. Well, no, I maybe, but okay, well, I'm not whatever. No. Yes. Wait, no. Okay. What's your last meal? It'd be my grandma's homemade chicken noodles just because they're so good. And I love they weren't my, chicken and noodles. I, and I love my grandma so much. So that's They weren't I, chicken noodles, Brittany. They were just noodles. No, I'm there's sure chicken broth in them, you idiot. Yeah, but not chicken. Yes, there was. No. Back in the day, there was. Before you were around. Yeah, there was. I'll ask her. She's fine. I'll ask her. Sophie, what's your favorite food? You have to answer. You have to go away. What's your favorite food? Hamburgers. Hamburgers, okay. All that's, right. that's not true at all, but okay. Um, You've done. Mm -hmm. Probably the hardest thing so far was when I decided to quit my job at the school to go to hair school because it was something I've always wanted to do, and I became the teacher because ultimately... <laughs> Remember, I was really smart in high school, and Dad told me, you're too smart to do hair. And I was like, okay, I'll just be a teacher. So I did that for a while, and I liked the job, but I didn't love it. 
and I knew what I was supposed to be doing. So I decided to do that, and um, it was she the best followed choice. her awesome sister and started doing hair. Too. I would say more grandma was inspo, but you for sure were second. But I mean, I, I started before you did, so. No, because she out, wasn't too smart to do hair. <laughs> defer me, yeah. <laughs> so, yep, go do the hair thing. You See, go do something. Okay. Um, what, what, that was like? Mine's you? more, um, what was like a physical thing. It was um, <laughs> physical and mental. It was probably running a half marathon. Like, that was, that was hard. <laughs> yeah. It was a it, half marathon awful? Yeah, it's just oh. a half even. Um, but most of it was all in your mind, though. That was really because I told myself I had trained like forever, and I was like, "You cannot walk any of this." And I didn't. Did you? So nope. Okay. And I won it. <laughs> you won? Yeah, but how many people were going to be? I mean, there was a three or? bunch of old people. I, mean, I, just, I don't really know if that counts. <laughs> all the ones who age were the full marathon. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It turns out the except for there was this one guy. It's a funny story. There was this one guy like in a cowboy hat running. He was running the full thing, and he was ahead of me. The Whole time, and he was running the full marathon. But whatever, I was only running a half, so I won. But did you beat him? He was running a full marathon. Oh. <laughs> okay. okay. One makeup item. What would it be? Well, as you can see, I use a lot of makeup items. <laughs> you guys don't even know what the real bread looks like. You don't. I don't know. Nope. You won't either. <laughs> you won't. Yep. It's Five thirty in the morning. It's on. That's real. I'm not ashamed of it. Jim, it's on. Just a little bit, Jim. It's not as much. But it doesn't matter. Like, it doesn't matter. It's fine. Oh, yeah. Jane still don't know where the camera is. Okay. <laughs> she went to hair school for that reason. Okay. <laughs> so. <laughs> for sure mascara. For sure. Like that wasn't even hard for me. Yeah. Probably same. Because I, yeah, probably. Really? Yeah. Not foundation or? No. <laughs> I'm just the slightest bit. I just have this natural glow about me. Uh, okay. I don't, I don't have to wear makeup all the time. You don't have to, but you should. Okay. <laughs> but I do. All right. Um, all right. Ooh, it's my turn. My turn. Even psychics. Hmm. Well, well, have you been to one, first of all? No. Okay, so you really can't answer that. No. Yeah, I can't. Because your first instinct to be like, yeah, right, no. Right? Am I wrong? Yeah. So, okay. 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 Well, do you believe in psychics? Okay. Too? Yes. But it's because I went to one this last year. Two of them were crap, but the third one I saw was incredible. So yes, and I when do. you say psychic, el elaborate a little bit more of what he was. Like he didn't read my cards or like do anything like that. He worked with energies more so. Like he kind of read my energy and like yeah, he could tell things. Really dug about deep. Me. Dug deep. And was correct, 100%. And I've talked to another person in my life who has some abilities and some talents there. And it was incredible as well. And you probably know who you are if you're watching this. But, um, yes, totally. Totally do. I don't think everyone has it that says they do. But, like, some definitely do. It was incredible. So. Fear. Oh, God. Um. Seriously, on a day-to-day -day basis, my biggest fear is that my kneecap's going to pop out again. <laughs> it's awful. It hurts so bad. So, I mean, just a quick answer there. My knee kept popping out. It hurts. My biggest fear... Oh, God, is this going to be deep? I was trying to dig real deep, but, but I can't put that into words, so I'll go basic. I really don't like snakes. Don't snakes? Like oh, that's a good one. I hate mm -hmm. those, too. Okay. This one time I had a dream that a snake came through the window. It was... It was real. Wow. So, yeah. It's amazing. <laughs> Human life. God, we're getting really deep in here. Bring us to use your gifts to help others. I've got the answer before you. <laughs> oh, my God, me too. <laughs> we didn't even rehearse these. No, we didn't. This is why we hang out so much. Yeah, I really think the human life is to just like find out what your gift is, share that, and be nice to people. I mean, really. Okay. <laughs> Most important thing a person can do to improve. You can answer this one first. I know. I don't even know what I meant by that question. Um. What's the like the best tip? I think or... honestly, is a making the decision. Like it has to be a concrete decision. It can't be like, oh, I think I want to do this. I have to change. Yeah. Like you have to make the decision and then consistency. Like keep going, keep going, keep going. 
Mine's going to build on that. Um, okay. You're going to have Nate. Um, I think uh, you'll, you'll get people in your life that like want to, they're naysayers or they might doubt your dreams or whatever you want to do, but they, they mean it. They mean well. They mean well, yes. But like, that's when you just thank you for your concern and keep going. Don't let it affect you or say, like, second guess yourself. <laughs> Weird, I know. Mm -hmm. Um, because, yeah. All right, that's the, that's the most important thing you can do to improve. That was the question, because we cut it off a little bit. Okay, tell yourself. <laughs> Procrastination. I'll do it tomorrow. <laughs> It'll be fine. I'll get all that shit done tomorrow. <laughs> Mine's like, oh, you look cute. <laughs> you look so cute. Yeah. No, maybe not. <laughs> no, it's not true. I know I look cute. Um, yeah, I'll do it tomorrow, or like, I don't care what they think. I don't care. A lot of times I don't, but sometimes there's a teeny bit that does. And it's like, shut the hell up. Like, no, I don't. And then I'm good. But what would Carol do? Yeah, what would Carol do? She'd be like, what? Yeah. Okay, there was like an answer I had in mind, I think, when I wrote that. It comes from yourself. You have to love yourself. Yeah. But you can't, okay, so you can't go, at, like, I truly believe, like, you can't have a sense of self-worth based on what other people tell you is good about you because then like you live by that you die by that it has to be like you believe it and it doesn't matter whether they like it or don't like it because it's one thing to be like I don't care what the haters say but it's another to be like oh they like it I'm gonna do it for more like because they like it like it can't be either of those things it's yeah. necessarily like yep I'm the shit and that is what it is yeah okay if you like it or not so I think okay that's all we had written down so is there anything else you want to tell, tell everybody before we go? Guys, can you, can you listen to Sophie singing? I don't know if you can hear it. It's really funny. <laughs> She's singing Baby Shark. Um, anyway, I know nobody actually cares, but um, it was really funny. So that's a little bit about um, us. Like, I feel like I want to ask one from left field here. Yeah, let's go left fielder real quick. Give me one minute. Hold my nose hairs out while we were thinking. Ugh. It's not hurt. Sure. Mm -hmm. No, no it's good. Close. No. Okay. God. Um, <laughs> if you could have any other career job besides what you're doing now, what would it be? And it better not be prostitute. Maybe it, it was, wasn't it? <laughs> Come on, get over here. That's tough because there's like a lot of. A lot of things, those of you that know me like know that I love my, my puppy dogs. I can't pick one. There's no way I could just pick one. Um, something with, not like a vet or anything, because that would suck, because you don't put dogs down. But yeah, like, a, a, mom and butts. Mm -mm. a doggy daycare, because like, how could you be sad at a doggy daycare? Or like something with, uh, like, I like could not a life coach, but like, I mean, always be like me. but like there's a lot of stuff up here that wouldn't <clears throat> maybe 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 that'd be fun. yeah I think we'd be super great life coaches I really yeah. think yeah. I don't know though because I'm not really good at like when people I'm don't good with listen to me using my words <laughs> well if people don't want to listen to me like I can preach all day but until like they decide I'd be like what the hell I told you this yeah yeah for sure however I do think I get it I get it now. I, I would totally do that. I don't think anyone believe me, but I believe me, so. Yeah. 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 But I know. Like a 20 hour video. So sorry. It's okay. If you think of other good questions, though, totally send them. Yeah. Because we will 100% answer all of them. All mm -hmm. of them. Doesn't matter what it is. That's our, that's our, yep, that's what we're going to do. 100% honesty. We're going to answer yeah. every yeah. question that's sent our way. So, yeah. So we got. Happy weekend. Merry Christmas. Christmas! Oh yeah. Sorry if I offend you. Yeah. Merry Christmas. I hope you have a great Christmas. She's not sorry. I mean, not in the slightest. Okay, bye. Okay, bye.